Have you ever wondered what would happen if you wore a face mask for 24 hours? Would the outcome make your skin better or would it make it worse? Can a face mask even last for 24 hours? And the biggest question, would it be painful? I guess we'll find out. Oh, oh I want to just scratch it all off now. Oh. What have you got? It's arrived. It has? The clay mask. I left the face mask to Rosie because I, I would have got something that was like extremely bad, like yeah. watery. And we need something that's going to stick on our face for the whole day. Do you reckon that's going to do it? I mean, I got it from Amazon. It had quite a few good reviews, so we're going to have to Let me see, it. see. I don't really know what the brand is. Ooh, okay. <laughs> that is such a bright green colour. Oh my God, is it really this? Oh my God, it's so green. <laughs> It smells a bit like seaweed. It smells quite natural. Apply a thin to medium layer on face and neck. Allow 10 to 15 minutes. <laughs> Rinse well. We're leaving it on for 24 hours. 24 hours. <laughs> but we're going to try to. Let's go and put this bad boy on. So we're going to be using this clay face mask on our face all day and wearing it for 24 hours straight. We're going to see how durable this thing is. Mm -hmm. Is it going to stay on us all day? Is it going to come off within an hour? We're going to do a bunch of things to really test it and see how long this is going to stay on our face because I think we're gonna get up to like three hours. I think it's gonna stay on our face all day. You do? But I think it's not gonna be great for our skin. Especially because my skin's really sensitive and I'm getting some acne right now. Yeah. I'm making sure I'm doing a nice thick layer so it's even more uncomfortable for you. Oh, it feels really cold. Does it? Yeah. But if you guys wear face masks, you'll know that they literally crack within 10 minutes. And if we're gonna wear this all day, I don't know how the hell this is gonna keep up, but it could. We just have to, I, I do this thing where like, you know when it's on your face, you start going. Yeah, no, don't do that now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to put it on my forehead because my hair covers my whole forehead. Yeah, you're going to regret putting that much on. If I don't want to put like not enough on and then it just it just all comes off. That's true. I'd rather put a bit more on and then it's like a little bit thicker. There you go. <laughs> that looks good. It's feeling so nice. Like it actually feels like spa quality face mask. It does. Okay, so it's been around 15 minutes. Rosie's now got hers done. Mine still hasn't properly dried yet. No, not yet. I think you might have put a bit too much of a thick layer on. You look good. Yours is way better than mine because you eat your forehead. Yeah. I mean, I could have my forehead, but it means having my hair all the way back all day and yeah. it doesn't, I don't look great. I've got quite a big forehead. Big forehead vibes. No, it's not. Got a really bad itch. Already? Already. No. Oh, no. <laughs> no, you have to leave it. How can I fix that? It's right there. <laughs> you look good right now. <laughs> What's the first issue you faced? The first issue I faced? On your phone. Oh, face ID. <laughs> it doesn't I work, mean, Yeah, I just, I just clocked that. Oh, I never put in my passcode. <laughs> That's so weird. Surely not. Let me just pull those different faces. It doesn't recognize you. I want to talk to you guys real quick about today's sponsor, and that is AirUp. So for those of you that haven't heard of AirUp before, AirUp is a little bit different. It is not just a water bowl. AirUp was made by understanding how the human brain works in the fact that what we can smell, we can taste, and what we can taste, we can smell. That's pretty much how it works. AirUp now has 25 pods for everybody to try, ranging from strawberry to peach to lemon to coconut, Coca-Cola, you name it, they've pretty much got every single flavor. And they've just released a brand new flavor called Virgin Mojito. But this flavor in particular is a lot different to the rest because it's the only one they've made that's a non-alcoholic flavor. Flavor. Most of you guys know that a mojito is an alcoholic drink that a lot of people drink on a hot day, on holiday, just on a summer's day. But if you're like me and Rosie, we don't really drink. We never have drunk. We don't really like alcohol. But sometimes when we're with friends, we can sometimes feel a little bit left out because we don't really want to drink. And despite this virgin mojito flavor tasting absolutely incredible, it means you can now enjoy this drink, which is alcohol free and it's just water. No bad things going in your body. It's just water and it tastes like mojito. Setting up an air up drink is by far one of the easiest things. All you do is pour water into the bottle, pick a chosen flavor and pop it on top of the lid then you have to pull it up to activate the flavor it takes five seconds and it's literally that simple and now with their brand new stainless steel bottles that range in two sizes from 480 mil to an 850 mil these bottles will now keep your water cold for over 14 hours and personally i think these are the best bottles that arabs ever made because they can almost hold just under a liter of water it stays cold all day and they just look a bit more mature more stylish and they just look great i genuinely think that arab is one of the best inventions because if you're like me i love flavored water and i always have i can't stand that every time you go to a shop and you pick up a bottle and it has 20 other ingredients in it sugars sweeteners and everything just you don't know you don't know what the hell's in that drink and it just doesn't look good it looks unhealthy it's annoying how you can't just drink a drink and feel healthy but enjoy a different flavor that is why air up so good because you can you just fill up the bottle and put your chosen flavor on it and that's it. No sweeteners, no sugars. Why would you not do it? And if you're like me and Rosie and you love keeping your body in good health, then water is the number one thing that you should be having more of every single day in order to be healthy. So why not do it in the healthiest way? So if you guys want to check out Air Up, I'm going to leave everything linked in the description. You guys can click that link, go check it out. Try some of the flavors and let me know what your favorite fit. What your flate. What? Let me know what your favorite flavored pod is in the comments. Let's get back to the video.
Okay, we've just made our lunch and Rosie's pretty much finished her lunch. Mm. This is a common thing. Mm -hmm. We make lunch and Rosie always finishes as I start because I have to like clean OCD weirdo. I have to just get stuff done before I eat. How have you found it eating? Is it hard? It's literally fine. I don't know what it is, but my face mask feels like it's not even on my face. Yeah, Rosie's face mask, I think I put on a thicker layer, but I can already feel my... When, uh, you, when you do that, can you feel it cracking? Yeah. Because when I move my face, it doesn't even feel like it. Look. Yeah, but you put yours on after mine. So yeah. maybe you've got like a little bit longer. Yeah, but look, feel that. It mine's the same. It doesn't even feel like I've got anything on my face. Yeah, but I've got a beard. That's why I Maybe we it. got too much of a good face mask. Yeah, maybe our face mask was too good. Maybe we should have got a bit of a crappier one. <laughs> You're gonna end up eating your face mask. Is it crack? No. That's a good sign. If we give it another 20 minutes, you're gonna feel it crack. The whole point of today is to see if it does crack. If it doesn't crack, it, it means we've got a good face mask. Mm -hmm. If it does crack, it means we've got a bad face mask. True. Facials are good, aren't they? Yeah, what are, what are they? Gluten free. Yeah, they taste like cardboard. It's awful, isn't it? Mm. We're trying to be gluten free for a week to see if it helps our bloating. And all the gluten free options taste awful. <laughs> It tastes like paper. Yeah. So we're on hour number two of having our face masks on. It's already getting extremely uncomfortable very quickly. Yeah, yours is peeling more than mine. Mine is peeling more than Harry's. I think it's because he put more of a thicker layer on his. His is more like dense to his face, but mine is literally like falling off. Like every time I speak, there's chunks of it going down my, my top. I have to keep actually like emptying them out. You know what's so weird though? Mm. Mine is still wet. Yeah, because you put on such a thick layer. It's been like almost two hours though. Like how would it still be wet? It's so it, wet. Because you put on so much. I know. Like so much. I feel like I can fill up here cracking. Yeah. And nose, around my nose. Yeah. Mine's basically half falling off already. My forehead, if I'm crack, oh, it's literally falling off <laughs> as I speak. Right, we're going to go to a drive through right now and we're actually going to go to a place called Dunkin Donuts. Yeah. They've just made a Dunkin Donuts in Manchester. Yeah. We've never been there. So we're going to get a Dunkin Donuts and we're going to get the employee's reaction to us both having face masks on. Oh, I'm embarrassed. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> They're definitely going to ask what's going on. Yeah. <laughs> it's so awkward. I think that's drying it. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely drying it. So we're at Dunkin and we've just realised it's not a drive-thru. I thought it was a drive-thru. I could have so sworn. <laughs> Even when this was getting built, I swear it was a drive-thru. Looks like one of us is going to have to go in then if I you don't... want your coffee. Mm, oh, I, I really want to try it as well. I really want to try a Dunkin' Donut coffee, whatever they do in there. I don't know if I can go in. You're the one that wants oh, coffee. Oh, fuck it. No, it's so busy. Is it? Oh my god, it's so busy. Oh. I can't, I can't do that. No, that's embarrassing. No. I can't. I'm not going in. You know, because it's like, it's a new it's thing. New. Everybody goes there. Oh, it's packed. Oh. There's like kids' birthday parties there and stuff. No, we're not doing that. I'm not doing that. You actually not? I'm actually not doing that. Yeah. I mean, if it wasn't so busy, I would have gone in there and I would have bought the camera. But that, that was like a full restaurant. Yeah. Do you know what's funny? Like when I used to watch YouTube before mm. I was actually like, before we did this as our job, I used to think, oh, everyone's so confident. And then I'd watch their videos and then like sometimes they were, sometimes they weren't. And yeah. I'd be like, you know what? I would do that. I'd go and do that. Yeah. And then when you're in that moment, like you don't want to do it. No. My like instant thought is like, go in there, have confidence. And then I imagine being in there and I'm just like this and everyone's looking at me and I'm like, Oh shit, Get me what do I do? <laughs> I can't do anything in public. I'm no. really bad at filming in public. I don't like it. It gives me anxiety, let alone with a face mask on that's like completely peeling. My face is so tight now, by the way. So yeah, look tight. Look I think it's actually falling off, look. Yeah, yours is looking Look down here, look. It's all falling off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, so Starbucks it is. Starbucks it is. And this needs to be a drive through. Mm -hmm. Starbucks drive through, holy speaking, what can I get for you? Hi, can I just get a small iced caramel latte? Hi. Hi. How are we looking? <laughs> Dry. Yeah? It's a bit crusty, isn't it? Gonna... I mean, yours is peeling off now. I know. We're going to see if it improves our skin. It's what do you think? A bit. I think it will. Yeah. Put Thank you so better, much. No problem. Awesome. Well, Have a good day. She was interested to see whether it would actually work. Yeah, she's our favourite Starbucks employee. She's always so nice. <laughs> yours is really Look dry. at my chin. Look at my chin. Oh, that's gross. So I'm trying not to move. I've got to that point now where I'm like, I'm trying not to move so much because if I do, it's all going to fall off. Yeah. I feel like a lizard. <laughs> okay, it's hour five and I can actually, if I'm looking up, I can actually see bits of hair, hair mask, bits of face mask like flaking off of me. <laughs> look, look, look at this bit here. It looks like a lizard, like a crocodile. Look at that. Oh. oh. I want to just scratch it all off now. Oh, it, I literally just want to scratch it off. Oh, you know you did that video on me where you had loads of holes yeah. and I didn't like it. This is becoming that. If you guys remember that, Rosie basically pranked me with loads of holes on, on her face because I hate holes. This is becoming that. How's mine looking? Yours is, oh my God. You know, it's got to that point now I can just go like this. Yeah. And it just 
flakes all over the floor. And we keep having to hoover because the dogs keep trying to eat it. So we have to get on the hoover straight away. <laughs> and I'm Constant like, I'm like, oh, hoop. oh, oh, there we go. Rosie's getting agitated. I'm, <laughs> You're I'm not liking really it. I'm really struggling now. I'm so itchy and I just want to literally just rip it all off. Like it's really, really agitating me. It keeps falling everywhere. It's, it's because it's got to the point now where like it's really tight on, on our faces. Yeah. That like any movement going like that. I can feel it. It there. just crumbles, right? I'm getting an itch here and then I'm and then it drops down on my chest and then it's itching me oh, here. Oh, it's like you've got ants all everywhere. Yeah, it's horrible. Sorry guys. Well, if there's one test that's gonna test this mask, it's riding a bike. I'm either gonna come back from this bike ride with no mask, or I'm gonna come back and it's gonna look like this. I'm hoping that it all stays on. If it doesn't, it's kind of annoying. But this is gonna be the ultimate test to really see how durable this face mark really is. Oh my God, this is so high. I swear my bike wasn't this high. Have I got smaller? I forgot to mention before I go, I'm actually really, really nervous. This, this is nerve wracking. I'm gonna get some beeps. I'm gonna get people looking at me. I'm kind of nervous, I can't lie. So uh, let's go and see how this goes. I need, to, need to turn the camera off real quick let's go My bike ride didn't do too well. It's all off. <laughs> My bike ride literally got all of it off. It's literally all coming off now. I haven't even got a face mask now. What's the point? <laughs> I've not even got any face masks left. Oh, mine's literally like completely peeling off as Yours well. Yours has done better than mine has though. Yeah, because I've not been out on a bike Guys, ride. Guys, look. I've got nothing left. Well, we started this challenge at 10 a.m. Mm -hmm. It's now 8 p.m. What's that? 12, uh, 10, 10 hours? hours? 10 hours we've had it on. I mean, it was going to be a 24 hour challenge, but I There's mean. There's no way I'm sleeping in this. We did half of it. Question is, is our skin going to feel better or is it going to feel worse? I think that my skin's going to feel crap after this. Mm. 10 hour face mask is now off. I'm not even joking. I feel like that green has been on my face for so long that it's stained my skin green. Does it feel better? I feel like I've just come alive. Really? <laughs> Ooh. It looks good. Feel my skin? Does it feel soft? Yeah, it does feel soft. This is quite a big moment. Give me your opinion. Yeah, it genuinely looks soft. I think Daisy thinks that as well. What do you think? Do you think it looks Does good? my face look soft? Ah, she thinks it looks good. No, oh my god. I think this is time to get it off, right? Ugh. I feel like I've just been burned. <laughs> 